minutes. Dilly, there is a dead man lying on our floor. I just need you to take Liberty to the other room for me. I can't have her and Maxine both falling apart right now. I'm going to go to prison. Minnie will be left on her own. Who's going to take care of Minnie? I just need to think. I didn't know it was going to bring a gun. Just shut up. You've got to believe me, I swear. Just shut up! It was only meant to scare you a little bit. Get the recording, delete it, and then go. I'm so sorry. I didn't have a choice. How could you do this to me? I can't, I can't do this. Not again. Max, you need to put that gun down. See, I didn't mean to do it. No, I know, it was just an accident, but right now you have to put that gun down so that nobody else can get hurt, okay? I can't go back to prison, I'd never survive it. No, I'm not gonna let that happen, I promise. Okay, Max, right now, we have to make a plan and you can't do that with that in your hands, please. Like you said, Minnie needs you. I can't, I can't do it. Yes, yes you can. Hey, Max, you have made it through worse than this. Hey, I'm here. You know, Morris is really going to lose it now, you know? Because Murphy's got people that's going to be looking for him. He's got a girlfriend, he's got kids. I have kids, Steve. Maxine has kids. Liberty has kids. And you let that man bring a gun into our house. You let him threaten our lives. Because Warren was threatening my family, see, and I didn't have a choice, OK? <laughs> I'm so sorry. There is nothing you can say that is ever going to fix what you have done to me tonight. Okay, so just just get out. You are dead to me. So just get out. Just get out. <laughs> Sienna. Sienna, quick. Did you find him? No. I'm gonna go and help our check. I think you've done enough. What if he, what if he's collapsed somewhere? We need to find him, Sienna. Max, it is too dark to look now, seriously. What if he's gone to the police? What, what if they're on the way here right now to come and arrest me? He is a violent, worthless criminal, okay? Oh. He's not gonna go anywhere near a police station, so we're fine, we're safe. Max, Max, stop, we have to get rid of this. I'll go and dump it and burn it. What can't you get through your stupid, thick head? I don't want anything from you, Stee. I risked my life to get that confession. I betrayed the psychopathic father of my children so that you could have some semblance of a life. Yes, I know, Sienna, and that's why I'm trying to just put things right between us. It really sent me help trying to keep you girls safe and out of this. We could have put Warren in prison. I was trying to protect my family. You're a pathetic. It's not Warren that your family needs protection from. It's you. You still here? Thought you would have hobbled back to your master by now. So your plaster cast is off? I cut it off before I come here. Yourself? Are you really so stupid that you would risk your own recovery to be Warren's gopher? He's more of a rat than a gopher, just like you. You called him? I had to. You tried to get me sent down again. And my kids would have grown up without a dad. What did you expect? Warren, you could have killed him! You stupid cow! Fine. And you stab me in the back again! Warren, please, I am the mother of your children. Shut up! You know, I swear on Sophie and Sebastian's lives that if you ever cross me again, I will finish you. Do you understand me? <sighs> Get up. <clears throat> We're leaving. Mm-hmm. <laughs>
<laughs> See? Stay. Look, you don't need to go with Warren. You can stay with us. First you kill my daughter, and then you let Sienna take my kids from me again. I'm sorry. You know I am sick and tired of hearing those two words come out of your mouth. You and Murphy have screwed up. I mean, how hard is it getting a phone from four women? You didn't tell me that there was going to be guns there. And where's Murphy gone now? Because his phone, it just keeps ringing out. I couldn't care less if he's dead in a ditch somewhere. All I care about is payback. We need to find it before the police do. You know what? I I'm not cut out for this, me. But look at the state of me. Well, and that's my fault, is it? No. It's mine. Yeah. You're damn right it is. Well, at least I told you about Sienna. I have just stabbed my best mate in the back and all she was trying to do was save me. I am dead to her now, Warren. I need people around me that I can trust. You can. You can trust me. Good. But if you ever cross me again, Steve, it won't be you who ends up in hospital. It will be that little rat, James. You wimpy kid and Princess Leah. And I will make sure that you are watching when it happens. Make sure you click here to get full Hollyoaks episodes right here on YouTube, or click here to catch up on all the latest drama in the village. And don't forget, subscribe to keep up to date on all things Hollyoaks.